here for the first of what are some very big races here at Orte in France, just in the Paris region, and we're starting off with a Carmarthen hurdle, grade three, two mile three furlongs, great debate, Leon Van Rensburg, Hurricane Fly, Ryan Tamasevi, Angel or Demon, the favourite, Joshua Sutherland, Broughton Zorro for Thomas Rogers, Colbrook answer, Graham Clutterbuck, El Tabo, Darren Thompson, Heber Awards, Ryan Costello, Icon today for Thomas Rogers, Lixnor, Darren Thompson, Rave Express, Craig Beckwith, Turbo Jet for Red Eyes, Elevation, Leon Van Rensburg, Lavender Blue, D. Hooley, Overcast, Ollie McCormack, Popular Class, for David Hooley, Raphael and Milet, and Rule of Maze, Craig Allen, and Zepp Novell for Jim Murray. And they're off and running here in the Paris region at Orte for a big day of racing and all over that first flight really well. And you can see that David Hooley runner, Lavender Blue, the front runner just bursts out into the lead and kicks on into that second hurdle. And there was a couple of mistakes there, a particularly bad one from Overcast that relegated that one to the rear of the field. So we've got a lot of good horses uh, lining up here, horses that have produced some group winning performances or big race winning performances so far. Popular class comes here, unbeaten angel or demon. One of the favourites comes in really good form as well, which is why those two are the short in the betting. Oh, a bad mistake there from Lavender Blue and had to recover quite quickly coming into that next flight. And Raphael Amilet was a little bit slow at the rear of the field, so they've got less than two miles left to travel here. Another one coming here in good form is Hurricane Fly for my stable winning a grade two over in Tipperary but the extended three furlongs here will probably be too much for that one today especially with that extra weight to carry but it's come over to France for a nice day out in the sunshine here at Autoy. So Lavender Blue still in the lead as we start coming into the back straight. Six flight of hurdles have been jumped already and Lavender Blue gets over that one much better. Zepp Novell wasn't too good at that and it allowed Angel or Demon and the two Leon Van Rensburg runners great debate and elevation to pass it as well as Rave Express. So they come to the next flight, Angel or Demon put in a really good jump and Hurricane Fly was perhaps a little bit slow and that one just dropped back into the middle of that chasing pack that are probably about seven lengths now behind Lavender Blue as they come past some pack stands here in Paris lots of race goers coming here today for particularly that feature race which is coming up in a couple of races time the Hay Josselin three mile three furlong race here for some of those champion chases that we have in this staying uh, chase division this season so all of the horses still in the contest at the moment there might be about 25 lengths from first to last but still a good 10 furlongs left to go and lots of hurdles left to jump and with the exception of the odd mistake, there's not been any t uh, any unseated riders or any severe mistakes other than the one put in by Lavender Blue a few fences ago. And when that happened uh, last week or the week before, it meant that the horse just lost its finish finishing burst. So will Lavender Blue be able to hold them off today and better the fourth place finishes she's had in the first two weeks? So swinging left-handed here into the final mile of the Carmarthen Hurdle. And it's Lavender Blue with a diminishing lead now of around three to four lengths. From Hurricane Fly, great debate and elevation. Uh, racing uh, on the outside and inside of Zepp Novell. That one for Jim Murray. Raphael Amilet's got ever closer for Craig Allen. Is just making some smooth progress into this race. Angel or Demon, who held second position earlier on in the race, has just dropped back ever so slightly, but still in the middle of that pack. And you can see a great jump there from Joshua Sutherland's runner in the black and red hoops. And look how much ground it made up off the back of that really slick jump. And it's not the first time it's done that in the race so far. So things are about to unfold here as we come into the final five furlongs and a bad time for elevation to put in a poor jump and that's relegated that one back uh, a few good few spaces so as they come over the next flight and land in an uphill and then quickly come into the next one a few of them are putting some really slick jump in their rule of maze is one that started to jump its way into contention Raphaela Milet hasn't been too clever at the last two and is now getting hard to work to try and make some progress so we're coming towards the final three furlongs it's still lavender blue in the lead as they come off that left hand turn and they start to come into the home straight it's lavender blue Lixnor's the one that's gone in hot pursuit now one of the outsiders rule of maze getting going on the outside hurricane fly trying to stay on but perhaps struggling with this extra distance Raphaela Milet coming through as well angel or demon perhaps being a touch outpaced looking for popular class the unbeaten horse that one's going to stay on because we know it stays two mile four but doesn't put in a particularly good jump there and it's only got a furlong to make up the ground and it's Lixnor that's burst into the lead Raphaela Milet with half a furlong left to go is thundering home down on the outside but Lixnor the outsider looking to spring a shock here Raphaela Milet is bursting home on the outside and just gets up on the line Raphaela Milet takes it for Craig Allen 
he was probably a bit nervous coming into this race that two mile three furlongs was a bit short but the horses burst home on the outside stayed on all day shown its class and Raffaella Milet gets back to winning ways after winning on week one runner up in week two returns to the winner's circle in those familiar green and gold hoops for Craig Allen takes it from L Lixnor uh, for Darren Thompson one of the two runners he had here on the day and uh, that one's come a really good second lavender blue for David Hooley couldn't quite last home but still a great run in third Angel or Demon fourth for Joshua Sutherland and popular class another of David Hooley's runner finishes fifth in the Carmarthen hurdle